Let's go over the plan. Should I be writing this down? No, no evidence. Now, Kev opens the theater at 5 o'clock. Our call time is 5.30. And the show starts at 7. I thought call time was at 6. No, it's 5.30. It was in the email Spencer sent out last week. You read the email, right, Paul? Yeah. Pay attention. Now, Kev won't leave the box office until scene 19. Why scene 19? Because that's when Kate has her kissing scene with Greg. He comes out just to watch that? Every rehearsal, every time, he's back there watching them kiss. Creepy. Completely. But that's our window. Mm. Now, Greg milks that kiss for way too long, and Kev stays back there to watch for a solid minute, maybe even two, tops. So once Kate says her line, You can't ask me to stay if I was never gonna leave. Such a powerful scene. God, it's such bad writing. But that's when we make our move. I'll make sure Kev stays where he needs to be. So just get in, grab the cash box, and get out. Then, all you have to do is hide the cash in that big pile of trash outside. Are you serious? I am. The trash isn't collected until Monday morning. So we'll just wait until the dust settles and come back for it later that night. I don't know, man. It seems a little bit too simple. It is simple. We're not stealing 500K from a bank vault. It's two grand from a lunchbox. This job's all about timing. This is so exciting. Did you guys hear CAA's coming? Come on, Greg. What? Well, just sit somewhere else. CAA's coming? I don't like to be isolated. I feed off the energy of my fellow castmates. Is that a problem? Hey! How about you shut up during my rehearsal? Or did you not know that's what we're doing here? I told them to stop talking, Spencer. Do you have to do that shit here? Yes, actually I do. Acupuncture helps me stay calm and center before I merge my being with that of my character. God, why don't you take about 30% off there, Jared Leto? Do you even care about your performance? Yeah, I know how good I am. It's this town that doesn't care. You are really good. All those TikToks and Insta sketches. Solid character work there, bud. Why are you even doing this then? I need the money. You're getting paid for this? No, no, I, I, I just meant uh, in general is what I meant to leave is what I meant, you know, to, to move back home. You're moving back home? No, that's so sad, sad face. This business is a sham, you know? It's a locked door frat house full of selfish top hats and bottom feeding fame mongers. Scene 19, now. You're an alien, you live on the moon, you can do this. I'm telling you, Greg, the kiss is quick, a peck. Less than a pack. The kiss is what the moment demands of it, Kate. Be an actress. Let's go! Okay, last rehearsal. You ready, amigo? So ready. All right. You can't ask me to stay if I was never gonna Go, 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 go. Bye. Sam, hey, smoke break? I don't smoke. No matter what my family says, I'm staying here with you on the moon. They don't care that you're Come on, here. Paul. I love you. She knows. You told her? I knew you'd blow yeah, this. The theater is mic'd, dumbass. I heard every word of your horrible plan since you guys started scheming it. It's not a horrible plan, first of all. I caught you, didn't I? Yeah, because you were spying on us, which is illegal, might I add. So... Who rehearses a robbery? Can you please not turn us in? She's not gonna turn us in. How do you know that? Because you would have done it already, instead of toying with us like this. That just... How much do you want? Paul! Rob! Your cues! You missed your cues again! Places? Meet us on the balcony after rehearsal.
I've done my best. The rest is up to you, which doesn't bring me much comfort. But here goes, just real quick. Kate, stop improvising lines. You're not good at it. And it's a play. Greg, remember you're blocking. Not for me, for Chekhov's sake. Namaste. Paul, your cues. Remember them. All the other lines of the play are contingent on, okay? And Rob, just don't forget to shave. I'm not shaving. Astronauts do not have beards. But they also don't tap dance on the moon, but I'm doing that. It's like the funniest part, though. <laughs> it is not a comedy. It isn't? I don't know what the big deal is. I'd shave my head if the role called for it. Then shave your head, jackass. Yeah, shave your head. All of you shave your heads, jackasses. Good luck. I still don't know what deal you're referring to. Half the prize. The prize? This ain't no arcade game, Princess Peach. Half. Half for just not telling on us? Yeah, and the other half goes to Paul, since he's the one taking all the risks. No, he's not. Yes, he is. No, I'm not. Am I? No. He's the one leaving the theater. He's the one taking the money. He's the only one that runs the risk of getting caught doing anything illegal while you wait comfortably backstage. I am taking all the risks. I told you it's a horrible plan. It's not a horrible plan, okay? We're all taking risks, even you now. So, I, I, uh, uh, three ways. What, what, what if we split it evenly three ways? Will I still give me enough to get new headshots? Deal. But if you get caught, I have nothing to do with this. Where's Paul and Greg? Screw Greg. I mean, yeah, we used to date, but that doesn't mean he can treat me like we're still a thing, because we're not a thing. Uh, why do they even have this thing? Oh. Ugh. Whew. Hey. You're late. No, what? No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Call time was 5.30. Call time's at 6. It's 5.30, Paul. It was in the email that Spencer sent out last week. Right, the email. Well, well, well. Look who decided not to shave. Shut the hell up, Greg. Well, somebody's a little bit nervous. Yeah, I'm not nervous. I'm just, I, I'm in character. And I have to take a shit. with this thing. So help me if you use tongue again. Kate, just be in the moment. Oh, son of a bitch. Oh my, Greg, are you kidding me? Ew, gag face. I'm sorry, I thought I got all of them. You're sorry, what diseases did you just give me? Look, be calm. I'm clean, I'm pure, I'm organic. Now, let's stop this. <laughs> C19. Whoa, are you okay? No, I, I don't think we could do this, man. I don't, I don't, I, this is so stupid, Paul. We could go to jail. It's not gonna happen, okay? Sam, she doesn't know what she's talking about. We can do this, all right? It's a good plan. Yeah, it is a good plan. It's a simple job, right? Oh, we could do this, okay. Okay, let's do this. That was not a simple job. No, it was not. What the hell happened? You can't ask me to stay if I was never gonna leave. Go, 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 go.
No. What? What? Where? No, 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 no. <laughs> Last stop. surprised. Now, can I just say, before things get out of hand here, your character arc, through that first act, it was simply stellar. It was DiCaprio level shit, I'm talking. Come on. A plus. Thank you. That means a lot. This isn't what it looks like. What it looks like? It looks like you couldn't stand to be upstaged by me. And your pathetic attempt to find a career out here with your YouTube videos and your Instagram meme challenges prove fruitless. So like the envious loser you are, you just had to ruin my groundbreaking performance with some half-baked rock. Oh, oh. I hate you! Spencer! Spencer! Oh my god! Craig can fight, man. Craig can fight? Yeah, I wanna blame the plan. It was a horrible plan. What did Kev say? <laughs> Only you're both banned. Craig and Kate are back together and I got fired. Wait, Kev didn't call the cops? No, he's got like three priors. He wouldn't call the cops if his life depended on it. Plus, I think he was more upset that Greg and Kate got back together. I swear he was like in love with Greg. So what are you gonna do now? I don't know. Walk back to Connecticut, I guess. Or jump off the Hollywood sign. Hey, you were on the show, weren't you? The tap dancing astronaut. Yeah, sorry about it. Oh, you were wonderful. Really? Yeah, I mean, brilliant character work. And that fight scene looks so real. <laughs> uh, well, we did a lot of rehearsing. Here, take my card. We could really use somebody like you on our roster. Thanks. Was that the agent from CAA? The Coenga Clown Company. <laughs> Chaplin was a clown. Yes, he was. All right, kids. It's enough excitement for one night. Let's do it again sometime, shall we? So what should we do now? Want to rob a clown company? <laughs> Oh, it hurts. 